Hey guys, I have here a hedge trimmer which is adjustable and it has a telescoping pole here by Apollo Smart. And it comes with an extra head here, um, which is a chainsaw. Really awesome. Has a little sheet. You want to make sure that you fill this reservoir with uh, bar and chain, or chain oil uh, prior to use. Um, and then store it somewhere where it won't leak. Usually, a lot of these things will leak, uh, I've noticed. So you want to store it somewhere, maybe you put it in a plastic bag, the head part. But um, I'm going to go ahead and put on this 20-volt uh, battery here to the edge. Uh, before I do, I want to show you that it does have um, a nice sheet for this as well. And the blades, uh, this, this head swivels down uh, for different angles, which is awesome. Because I'm going to be trimming a uh, probably a 10-foot bush. Uh, well, maybe not 10. Maybe it's a 9-foot bush uh, this morning on top of it. And this uh, is a good feature because I want to just trim the top, top part. I've got the sides already. Um, so that's great. It's got an angle on it. And it also has these uh, clips that you open up to uh, extend the shaft out, however uh, far you need it. I'm going to be able to do that with one hand, but uh, I'll show you later. Um, it also has a nice belt here, which you can put around your strap or on your shoulder to help you if it's too heavy for you. Uh, this adjusts to anywhere on this in this area here that you need it and it has a, a couple of safety features it has you know two step trigger here and as well as a different uh, uh, degree angle here which the whole thing swivels if you uh, have two heads to use here and you swivel this to whatever angle you need it which is great um, helps in uh, transporting it around and getting in the right angle where you need to, to cut. So I'm gonna go ahead and start it up and uh, get it going. All right, one more thing I wanted to show you here. Before you do plug it in, you have to remove this cap on the end. Otherwise, you're not going anywhere with it. It will not fit in the shaft. Uh, this is just a protective cap, so these do not get bent, and it has to be removed to be able to use it. All right, I just trimmed the top of that bush. I thought I was rolling, but I was not. 